Hi you guys and thanks once again for joining me on another video. If this is your first time, welcome. So this video is going to be about a Michaels haul and a Dollar Tree haul. So my Michaels haul is really, really short. I only got these two paper pads and they were about $5 each. And so this one has 16 designs with three sheets each in them. And I thought that this one was pretty cool. I was pretty late to the sale. Um, so a lot of the paper pads had been picked over already. Um, a couple of them were damaged. But I saw this one and I liked some of the prints in it. Definitely can use the solid colors. So that's it. This is Tropic Bliss. And then the next one is It's Your Day. And this one was also five. And here are some of the sheets in there. Love some of these papers, the gold falling in them. This would be a really cute addition to my collection for birthdays. So that's it for Michaels. So while I was out there in them streets, I went to another Dollar Tree. I went to a different Dollar Tree that I don't usually go to, and I found a few more items to pick up and add to my stash. So the first thing are these doilies, and y'all, am I tripping? Y'all, did Dollar Tree already have these doilies? I don't know. Maybe because I'm looking at lace and things more so I can craft with them. Um, but anyway, this is a two-pack doily, 100% polyester, so... You girls that do the sublimation can probably use this. I don't know. This one is an off-white one, and this one is white. And, of course, I would use them to um, cut up and use in my crafting. So I picked up three of those. I found this cute Halloween fabric, and it has the spider webs and some spiders on it. And then I also got the decorative mesh, and this one is like the snow tool, but it's in black, and I thought that that would be cute, especially for Halloween. I found a few packs of stickers, so I got this one with the holographic in the background, and also this one, and I love these last year and I did so much with them so I picked up two packs of these nope I picked up three packs of those and I picked up a pack of these and these these were the ones from last year for sure and a pack of those and I saw this this is a glass sticker and it comes with four pieces and I thought that they kind of look like lace and they would probably be cute in crafting as well. I did find some of the ribbon. So this one is the one with the skeletons on it. Really cute pattern. And then this black and white. And then this black one with all of the glitter in it is gorgeous. I love that one. I did find some of the glass bottles with witch's brew, wool of a bat, trimmed spider hair, unfiltered poison. I think these are cute, so I picked up some of those. I did find the ones with the jack-o'-lanterns on it. Cute, cute, cute. And then I picked up some of this. So this is the red, pink, and green gingham. And then I also found some cutting dies. So I picked up two of the ones with the leaves on it. Super cute. And then I also picked up two of the ones with the hearts on them. I also picked up some lash glue by Ayani and I was actually looking for the lashes because I saw a couple of people haul them and that they have pretty good lashes. So I did not see the lashes, but I saw the glue. So I went ahead on and got that. So I found this cute little journal and I only found the one. Otherwise, I would have picked up a couple of more. I think that this one is really, really cute. And these are stickers to go with it. So really cute. And then I finally, finally, finally found 
the strawberry items at Dollar Tree. I found the magnetic photo frames with the strawberry, the avocado, um, the rainbow, and a little flower with a face in it. And I found the matching paper clips. I found the bookmarks. I got two of those. And that might be it for the strawberry items. And then I found these water bottle sticker books, which I have never seen in the dollar store. So I'll open one. So be happy, be good, do good, feel good, good vibes. So nice big stickers. I like this cool. Look at that llama with the sunshades on. And you got this and be kind. So that's a pretty cool book. I picked up two of those. I also found the standard grip mats from Dollar Tree. So this is super interesting. So I do use a standard grip mat in my Cricut Maker. But of course I use a larger one. So this is the size of my mat compared to what this is. This one I believe is for the Cricut Joy. And it does seem like it's pretty sticky, so that's kind of cool. So I'm interested if I can actually slide it through my Cricut Maker anyway, like maybe on the side or something. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but I thought that it was super cool that Dollar Tree was carrying it. So I just went ahead on and picked up two. I'll find something, I'm sure. Okay, I also saw this little notebook and it says Tropical Vibes. It's in green and this one had a pen with it and I thought that that was really cute. So it has three notepads on it. I like that. And then I picked up a pack of pearl crayons. I had been wanting to try this to do some wax seals. You just cut them up, mix them with some hot glue sticks and make some wax seals. So um, I definitely want to try the pearl color to see how they turned out. So I went ahead on and got this pack. And then the last thing I picked up were these peel boxes. So I had been seeing like the double sided ones that had the blue case on them, but I wanted to alter some. I'm actually going to do a swap in a couple of months to alter one of these. So I picked up a few of those. And then the last thing I purchased were these cute little glasses. And of course they remind me of what you would put an ice cream or ice cream sundae in. Super, super cute. So I just got two of those, but I also think that it would be cute for those who do the fake bakes. Um, it would be super cute to like stack this up with ice cream. This concludes my Michaels and Dollar Tree haul. If you like this video, then give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please consider doing so and leave me a comment. I appreciate you so much and until next time you guys, bye-bye.